families of some of the men killed in the Pike River mine explosions are picketing the site to stop it being sealed. The government announced in March funding had run out and it would be closing the mine. A representative of 22 families says a crucial piece of machinery, a fan, remains in the mine and it could cast light on what caused the explosion in 2010. I spoke to Bernie Monk who lost his son in the disaster. Well, we're challenging um, the government's stance on rushing the uh, sealing up of the mine. We've put plans on the table which they've just disregarded. We want the mine left unsealed to after the police investigation. And I, I don't think that's too hard a thing to ask for. So this picketing action, is this a last resort? Well, it's just hammering home. Like, like a great example of that is, we, you know, the, the workers up there, they know that the job can be done. The government is saying that there's no money left. We've put the plans on the table that are, don't even smoke any of the figures that the government have put on the table. So I don't know where they're getting their, their information from because they've never had any dialogue with us. But it's just ridiculous what they're doing because if the police in their drill, drilling operations, find things of significance that needs to be investigated, how the hell are they going to investigate them when they've sealed the miner? So you're confident the workers won't cross the, the picket line uh, there? I, I, well, I, I don't think they will. And we'll be standing there, we'll be standing there at the gate to greet them, to stop them from doing it. On the other hand, we will not, and I repeat, we will not, interfere with the police's work of what they're doing because we you know we want them to do the job that they're doing they're hoping to hand the mine over to doc in in august mm -hmm. so they're doing it very quickly how long are you willing to to, to pick it there for to as long as it takes and that was a representative of some Pike River families, Bernie Monk. The police say they have been in contact with the group to ensure everyone's safety. RNZ has approached the Minister for Pike River Recovery, Andrew Little, for comment.